you look, it grabs hold. Crowds in New York have had their eyes to the skies in an alleged UFO sighting. Dozens of videos posted online show passersby seemingly staring at a group of unidentified flying objects in the sky over Manhattan. Adding mystery to the event is a prediction by a retired air defense officer. In a recent book, he claimed that on October 13th, the day of the sighting, of course, a fleet of UFOs would hover over the world's principal cities. But many witnesses insist that's indeed what they were seeing. Uh, alien spaceships, while others say it looked more like a group of hot air balloons. But they are also aware that their sudden interaction w w with mankind will cause a great deal of fear and panic, like Orson Welles' program on the uh, War of the Worlds did in 1938. So the aliens will reveal themselves in a massive UFO display over our principal cities uh, as the first step. They won't land, but they will do so. And I predict that this is, will happen on October 13, 2010, in about four months' time from now. That's a major step for me to take because I'm putting my credibility and my book on the line about this. I'm so sure that this is going to happen. It may not happen on October 13th. It may happen in November and December. It will happen this year. However, they won't land this year, but they will, that will come later. But it is a first step in our future relationship with, with the uh, alien reality and then our world will have changed forever. <sighs> and there's more of them coming from there, look at that. Yeah. in New York City, a sighting that had even jaded New Yorkers scratching their heads. A mysterious silver shiny object, or objects it seems, floating in the sky yesterday. You can see all the people have stopped in the street there in their tracks looking at it. Some folks say they saw lights. Others were maybe waiting for little green men to arrive. Law enforcement officials believe it was some kind of balloon. So far though, no confirmation. And as they said on the X-Files, the truth is out there. Before there was only one now there's like four, and then now there's just one again. I'm freaked out. Everybody's freaked out. This dude's across the street with M16s and shit. Fucking police officers driving around. I need to go to work. That's a fucking low-ass plane. That plane is fucking low, yo. Holy shit. I don't know what the fuck's going on. People are stopping in the streets. I don't know if this is the last day on Earth. But... I'm still living. I'm happy about that. I'm still working. Oh, shit. Better not die today, yo. These niggas are flying above us. This is everybody hates Lex reporting, and I'm out. Morning 2010 right now. There are UFOs flying above the city right now. Can't see 
because they're so freaking high up. At first it was one, before there was only one, now there's like four. And then now there's just one again. I'm freaked out. Everybody's freaked out. Heads turned skyward in Manhattan this afternoon. A series of white dots in the sky prompted stares and more than a few phone calls to police. The NYPD doesn't think those are UFOs. They suspect they're just balloons of some kind. But the sight still left a lot of people wondering. Hmm, is that you, Chris? Were you on your rooftop again? No, no, that wasn't me. Huh, you sure? <laughs> You sure? Nope. Playing tricks on all of them? Not taking credit yeah, for this one. Right. Making Not your animal it. balloons up there. Okay. And there's more of them coming from there. Look at that. Yeah. Some unexpected guests apparently have paid a visit to Hangzhou. The city known as the Paradise on Earth may have attracted the attention of some celestial visitors. Shen Le has the story. At around 8 o'clock in the evening, an unidentified flying object was spotted hovering the sky above Hangzhou's Xiaoshan Airport. In the next hour, the airport was shut down. We received orders to shut down the airport until the sky is clear. As a result, outgoing flights were grounded and incoming flights were diverted to nearby Ningbo and Wuxi. Normal airport operations resumed nearly two hours later. Residents near the airport have taken two photos of the object. One in daylight shows a clear comet-like tail and another taken at night features a glowing object emitting golden light. Aviation authorities are still investigating the phenomenon and no further details have been released.
。六月三十号，新疆地区上空也曾出现过类似不明飞行物的物体，引发网友极大关注。有人说是 UFO， 有人猜是美国加州发射的洲际导弹，甚至俄罗斯飞船。看来，不明飞行物频频造访，是天外来客还是另有玄机？谜团仍有待解开。凤凰卫视综合报道。嗯萧山机场封锁，大批航班被降宁波和无锡。因为呢，机场工作人员在机场上空发现有不。七号晚上九点左右，杭州萧山机场上空突然出现了疑似不明飞行物。在八号下午举行的情况说明会上，机场方面表示说，航空监管部门正在对疑似不行不明飞行物进行调查。